Hello, brothers and sisters of light and dark. Welcome, welcome, welcome to my page. My page is about common sense, and I try to keep it down under the nitty-gritty under 10 minutes. And if it goes over 10 minutes, it's something very, 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 very important and unimportant to liberals, libertards, people who believe in God, people like to smoke, people like to drink, people like ayahuasca, people like DMT. That's about 80% of you masses of asses. Please do not listen, do not subscribe, and do not continuously go down the rabbit hole because I don't go up your asshole, even though I'm sounding like what you think I am or not. I am not that at all. Okay, please be gone. Now, if you have any comments, questions, insults, or roasts, you put it down below. Okay. Now, this is going to answer questions. It's going to answer one question. Why do I not consistently post all the time? I only make 500 videos per Mothius Knowledge because my shit is explicit and too hardcore for the YouTube algorithm. It is too cringy or either or something that is not really in breaking the policy. Okay, right? I don't break policy. I don't do anything, but they will flag my video sometimes. Some people will bypass my intro, right? And still continues to listen with their stupid ass, okay? And then get fucked up and get sensitive. I completely said it in the beginning. I do not want none of your fucking viewership or none of your subscribers. But if you want to subscribe and you are interested in something I'm saying, you can actually help me, okay, through my Patreon, okay? Or Cash App. It's all listed down below because you're not going to see anybody else like me. I am 48 this year. I have two dogs. I travel to the Gambia. I travel to Ethiopia. I travel to Cairo. And I got videos of all of that shit. And I'm on Pornhub, which you have to pay, okay? And on the OnlyFans as well. So, behind a firewall, you'll see some shit that's completely different out of this world. And I'm not, I just don't teach shit just to guys on how to improve their lives. I teach esoteric alien type shit as well. If you scatter throughout the internet under Mothius Knowledge, okay? I have seven channels, but two of them have been removed over time because they're either too much for YouTube or people have been reporting them, okay, for something I do not know. I read the policies for the YouTube, yes, but they, they, what, they, what YouTube does, they actually read the transcripts and then they take it out of context. They don't understand what comedians are, they don't... They don't really bother. They just cut it again. Okay? All right. So I know that's why I'm also on Rumble. I'm on MeWe. I'm on Signal. I'm also on Gitter. So you know how to get to me, okay? Right? Okay. All right. Okay. Now, I do not make videos consistently on a daily basis because I have daughters. I do research, and I all, I am a gamer. Okay. I am physically active in the summertime. It is summer now. I do not stay. I'll make like five videos or ten. Depends on the time of day. Depends on my mood. I am not that ambitious. I live free or die trying. I do not need a lot of money. This is why I do not join these other congregations. You put me in a group, I will leave the group because I have many times. I teach English dynamically, internationally. I do things worldwide. I do not do what a lot of beta alpha males Two beta male cucks do on the YouTube. I do multitudes of things. I am extremely busy. And on top of that, I have to deal with the introspective voices, the raison d'etre that be fucking with me every day. All right? Okay. I teach other, I do other things. If you check that credential now, you're like, yo, this dude is fucking on fire. I do not read a script. If I join someone's fucking stream, I should be getting paid because what happens is that either one or two things is going to happen. The audience is going to see me as someone as mentally ill because I'm generational ex schizo, okay, and a psychopath, a good psychopath. I take out bad people. I'm a vigilante like Batman. Yeah. And I do magic and all that other stuff. But they don't want, nobody wants to hear that shit. I talk to the devil, the angels, and God at the same time. The internal, external God, all of the above. They, nobody wants to hear that shit. As eccentric as I am, I keep it on the low because I'm no hoe. Okay, I try my best to help you guys out who are actually listening. The few guys in far between, you follow me. I told you 500 videos per Martha's Notch. 
I'm not going to label it like Alpha Knowledge. And I know some of you guys want me to change the name. No. Do your thing. Everyone is unique. I do not need a script. I do not talk slow. When people talk slow, they have lacking education, okay? Okay, is they lack the education. That's just my opinion. Most people around me lack education. I keep telling them be renaissance. Always keep reading, learning, keep learning. I tell my wife this all of the time. My lady this all of the time. Okay, always keep learning. You always have something to say. H have multitudes of topics. Just don't talk about alien shapeshifters or the, the Skinwalker Ranch, okay? Or Zachariah Ascension, okay? Or Chariots of the Gods. We don't need... I don't want to talk about that too much. I'm trying to help certain particular people who are not awake. Most people, 80% of people are not awake. Because they're either believing in an external god and they're into religion. So I don't talk about that stuff often. Okay? I can give you some pointers and lead you to the path. But you might not be ready for that path. Most people are not ready for that. Too many millennials. Too many people with emotions. This is why I don't make constant videos i got other things to do look at this man look at this okay everything is a blessing to me because of my inner demons or demons okay or angels or protectors okay i sit alone here like in isolation with my daughter my daughter is busy doing her own thing okay i have two daughters okay Okay, and other than that i'm okay i'm the magic man you need some spells you got that's a that's a charge I try my best not to do that for people because magic spells work differently for everybody. Okay, my TikTok is blowing up as it's supposed to. I am the Emerald Pillar King, okay, on TikTok, okay. And of course, since I did not reach 1,000 followers, I cannot start my live therapy sessions because of the fact that there's a lot of limitations on people trying to put, um, a muzzle on people who want to speak freely, okay, without breaking their fucking policies, their ball-like fucking policies. And then they'll read a transcript and they don't even understand the context of the fucking transcript, okay? But they don't understand that when they keep doing that to the wrong people, they'll get cursed because that's a big overhead business, okay? I was on MySpace before I got on fucking Facebook, man. I was blowing up on fucking MySpace, Okay, I was getting paid a thousand a month back in the past, but I don't do that now. I don't do fetish gigoloing no more. I did that shit all through in Pennsylvania and shit. I learned it from the pimps in Brooklyn, and I did that shit all through in Pennsylvania. Then I traveled to North Carolina and shit, and I tested it out, and I shut my mouth clear because I realized I could make money off of this. So this is why I want to keep it on a hush-hush, because I don't want to be as popular as fucking Kevin Simp Samuels. Rest in peace. I don't want to do that. I don't need the popularity. There's too much power I have. Okay? But, Martha's Knowledge 8 is coming up. So get ready for it, guys. Get ready for Martha's Knowledge 8. I may be traveling to Kenya next year. I'll be doing interviews with women who claim to say, quote unquote, like the other past girl who think she, she lied and said she was a virgin, to see if she's a virgin or not. Sometimes some girls are actually raped, but they don't want to tell me, but I still can tell if they've been raped or not. It doesn't take too much to figure that out for me as a past gynecologist, personal gynecologist. Lots of women don't know me because it's, I'm old, okay? And I'm not a fucking Bill Cosby or a fucking R. Kelly. I don't do crazy shit that everybody think I do. No pedophilia. I don't do none of that shit. But I did get caught up in some shit like that in the past. But I give advice to guys who are just lost. All right? These days you have to check ID now because women do lie. And even if they have an ID, that's not enough. Okay? You got to take pictures. You got to actually go find their parents and shit. You got to know where they live at. Okay? You got to do research. Alphas always do research. But anyway, this video is about to end here. And guess what? Come on! Joe Average Man, I'm not your Peter Pan. Peace.